Did you know that there are different types of orgasms? What is the influence of social media on building self-image and sexual self-esteem? Hello to all lovers of psychology and sexuality. Today, we will unveil the sexual curiosities of women. If you are interested in these topics, make sure to subscribe and activate the notification bell to not miss our future videos. Also, leave us comments and share your experiences in the section below. Let's get started. It's fascinating to discover that there are various types of orgasms, and each person can experience them uniquely. From clitoral to vaginal, or even blended orgasms, exploring your own sexuality allows you to better understand your body and fully enjoy your intimate experiences. Social media can impact self-image and sexual self-esteem by exposing individuals to beauty standards, generating comparisons, and pressures to meet ideals. Social validation on these platforms can affect self-esteem. It is crucial to cultivate a realistic and positive perspective of sexuality and body image. Adventure and free spirit. Some women are attracted to men who are adventurous and willing to try new things. Aging effects. With aging, the quality of erections and the ability to achieve orgasm may change. Older men may experience a decrease in erection firmness and increased difficulty reaching orgasm. Anorgasmia is the inability to achieve orgasm. It can be caused by physical or psychological factors and may be treated with sexual therapy. Authenticity. Being authentic and showing oneself without pretending to be someone else can be very attractive to many people. Breast size and desire. Studies have shown that there is no significant correlation between a woman's breast size and her ability to arouse sexual desire in others. Attractiveness is subjective and varies from person to person. Common practice. Despite associated stigmas, anal sex is a common sexual practice and can be enjoyed by many couples as an additional form of intimacy. Confidence. Confidence is a trait that many people find attractive. Women are often drawn to men who demonstrate self-assurance in themselves and their actions. Cotard syndrome is a rare disorder in which a person believes they are dead or that their genital organs have disappeared. This condition can affect one's perception of identity and sexuality. Cultural stigma. Despite growing acceptance, anal sex has often been surrounded by cultural stigma, which may affect some women's willingness to try or talk about it. Diversity of sexual orientations. Sexual orientation is diverse and goes beyond heterosexuality. It includes orientations such as homosexuality, bisexuality, pansexuality, and many others. Each person has their own unique orientation. Effects of pornography. The consumption of pornography can have varied effects on people. Some may find that it enhances their sex life and intimacy, while others may experience negative effects such as erectile dysfunction or relationship problems. The key is balance and moderation. Emotional intimacy. The ability to establish a deep emotional connection and express genuine love and affection is often considered attractive. Empowerment of the partner. Valuing and supporting the growth and success of the partner is important in a relationship. Eroticism has been a source of inspiration for artists throughout history. From cave paintings to Renaissance masterpieces, the human body and sexuality have been common themes in art. Evolution of contraceptives. Throughout history, contraceptive methods have evolved from rudimentary practices to more advanced options like birth control pills and intrauterine devices. Expressive eyes. Eyes are a central feature in attraction. Expressive eyes and good eye contact can be particularly attractive. Fantasies and role-playing. Anal sex is often incorporated into fantasies and role-playing. Exploring shared fantasies can enhance emotional connection between partners. Female masturbation. Masturbation is a common and healthy practice for both men and women. Although there has been stigma around female masturbation, it is an effective way to learn about one's body and experience pleasure. Financial security. Having financial stability and the ability to plan for the future can be attractive to some women. Foot fetishism is a common sexual fetish where a person is attracted to feet. It may involve foot worship, massages, and other erotic acts. Health effects. Orgasms have been shown to have health benefits, such as the release of endorphins acting as natural painkillers and improving mood. History of condoms. Condoms have a long history dating back to ancient Egyptians who used linen wraps. 
Over the centuries, they have been developed and improved with various materials, including animal intestines and modern latex. Influence of food on sex. Some foods are considered aphrodisiacs due to their supposed ability to increase sexual desire. Popular examples include chocolate, oysters, and avocado. Influence of technology on sexuality. Technology has changed how people experience sexuality. Online connected applications and sexual toys are examples of how technology has integrated into modern sexual life. Japanese sex culture. Japan has a unique sexual culture that includes practices such as kawaii, cute, and wabi-sabi, the beauty of imperfection. It is also known for its adult entertainment industry. Karetsa is an approach to sexual intimacy that focuses on emotional connection and mindfulness rather than orgasm. This practice promotes prolonged and deep sexual relationships based on the idea that controlling arousal can strengthen the connection between partners. Love and sex. Love and sex are closely related in the human experience. Emotional intimacy can significantly enhance sexual satisfaction and sex can strengthen emotional bonds. The combination of love and sex can be a source of enrichment in relationships. Male anorgasmia. Anorgasmia, the difficulty in reaching orgasm, can also affect some men. It can be caused by emotional or physical factors and may be treated with sexual therapy. Masturbation in the Bible. Although masturbation has often been viewed as taboo in some cultures, the Bible does not explicitly mention masturbation. Interpretations vary. Multiple orgasms. Some women can experience multiple orgasms in a single sexual session, involving one orgasm after another without a refractory period, enabling continuous pleasure. Myths about virginity. There are many myths surrounding virginity, such as the belief that breaking the hymen is a sure sign of virginity loss. In reality, virginity is a social and cultural construct. Nonverbal communication. The ability to communicate through gestures, eye contact, and positive body language can be very attractive. Orgasm control. Some men practice orgasm control, also known as the edging method, which involves intentionally delaying orgasm to prolong sexual pleasure before allowing themselves to climax. Orgasm through thought, rarely. Some people can experience an orgasm through thought without physical stimulation. This is called mental orgasm or contactless orgasm. Orgasms during childbirth. In rare instances, some women experience orgasms during childbirth. This is due to the stimulation of certain nerves and is not something all women experience, but it is a curious and little known phenomenon. Painful coitus syndrome, also known as dyspareunia, is a condition where a person experiences pain during intercourse. It can be caused by various reasons, such as medical, emotional, or physical issues. Human sexuality is a fascinating and diverse field that never ceases to amaze us. Sexual curiosities unveil the wonderful complexity of the human experience in the intimate realm. As we explore and understand these facts, it is crucial to remember that each individual is unique in their sexual experience. Respecting and communicating with your partner are the keys to a satisfying and healthy sexual life. Sexual education and understanding are essential tools for fully embracing our sexuality.